Hey there everyone, this is Outcabling Donkey Kong Land. Last time we stepped upon World 2 and did a level in this land of mysterious objects with temples. That's the part that matters. Here we go on the s oh, we're swimming now. Hi there, Barrel. Alright, so swimming level, but with a temple. Uh, like, that's kind of neat. It's, it's a sunken temple. There's a giant fish. That's basically Boundy Base. There's that weird flower object. It's having fun. Am I safe here? I guess so. Alright, well, you know, you keep on bobbing and, uh, look at that. We got, like, these are completely new fish. I guess they're here because they're, like, not as long. Like, they're a bit stouter, like, a bit more smooshed and horizontally. So that they fit into the environment. Whoops, well, I got hit in a dumb way there. But, like, I'm like, well, there might be something cool underneath. There wasn't. But there might have been. <laughs> Gotta take that chance, man. Hey, look at that. My gorilla pal. Oh, jeez. Whoa there, buddy. Oh, yeah, that guy's excited to take off. That guy's gonna fall. There we go. So I'm understanding these animals now. Guess I'm not going for Kong. Like, I just, I don't want to endanger myself for an O. Oh, like, I know I can save like that, but there are many ways to fix a clock. You know, as they say. Back in the old days, well, there's a midpoint in Sky Portal. Here we go. Give me a thumbs up. Give me a tally ho. These guys are having fun. Whoa, yeah, I got, I got hurt, and I just rose from the nethers, getting me my thing. Uh, where are you guys? Thank you for appearing. Uh, okay, so like, okay, there's a DK barrel in there. It's protected by this little sunfish. It's not a sunfish. It's another kind of tropical. I do not know a lot about fish. I am not a fish expert. I have never claimed to be a fish expert. Anyone who claims otherwise is obviously trying to curb my authority at the Orange Juice Convention. A highly political group and with a lot of backstabbing and naysaying and the comparatives of exotic birds. So, like, I get it. But please supply, whoa, with delicious orange juice. I said orange juice again. It's just, I don't know, I got that on my mind. Hey, fish! A fish said hi. <laughs> it, just, it just popped up like, hey, I'm a fish. How about you? No, I am, I am not a fish, my friend. Nor have I ever aspired to be one. Uh, but I'm glad to have met you nonetheless. Now, if you will please purchase one of my catalogs for a paltry sum of $24.99 and uh, we can forget about that whole unfortunate exchange. No problem, Sally Ho. Alright, well, glad to have met you. Oh, I, at least I still got a DK in the backseat of- what? Well, okay. <laughs> no, uh, the thing just kind of stood there for like five years. Uh. So I don't know. What it is, there's something a little imprecise about how swimming feels like it works in this game. Okay, um, alright. I didn't expect that to happen. Like, I keep I'm wondering, oh, it's a G. I didn't get most of the letters. See, I, I saw that thing between a guy, and I was like, well, I should check it out. Hey, there's more level behind the end. Oh, man. Finally, oh, and there's the other end. <laughs> Two layers of end. I didn't get any bonus, but there weren't any bonus in the first DK, and there ain't no bonus here in the water here. Like, I meant underwater, not like in total. Hey, you're swimming some more, but this time it's very much Donkey Kong water. Check it out. We even got like a simulation, a little bit of the of the music, even a little bit. No, yeah, no, totally. It's a pour of the song. Alright, here we go, getting mushy old wet bananas. A giant fish swings by. Yeah, you can go through walls. That's what underwater levels are all about in this game. 
going through walls all the time. You don't know where you're at to and fro. Look at that giant blade just spinning around in the water. That thing has a face. I guess it doesn't. Maybe look at that guy. Maybe that would indicate. So, whoa, geez. Well, arrows want me to go down, but I want to go up to look around. That made me meet with an enemy. That guy is really excited to be here. Uh, um. So, where would you suggest that I go? That is relatively safe-ish. I guess that's all the ish that I need. All right. Well, there's a wall there, bopping. This might be the level. Like this is just. Well, I went a bit too far. Like, again, like, I don't know. I feel like I don't have as much control as I want sometimes, but it might just be an illusionary force at hand. Uh, there's something about something. That's fine. Look at that. Oh, uh, there was a gorilla, and he rose to the sky. Happy to have evoked his purpose in this world of lies. That's where I died. See if there was a purpose that death. No, I think this might be where the level actually goes. Oh, oh well, yeah, I got hurt there in a silly way. That's fine. And like, what's down here? Is, is there just no? That's a K cave. All right. Oh man, you're you're putting a lot of importance in these letters. Well, considering that's how you save normally, I kind of get it. I'm gonna go around the circle. Yeah. Video games! Alright, check it out, we're here, and then we're gonna- Oh, there's a midpoint, I died very close to the midpoint. Gonna go here, see these bananas, they leave me, they lead me to where I'm protected by a large fish that lazily moves back and forth like a large fish would if he had to. Maybe he doesn't, you can go here, no you can't, it's just a cool place, back and forth, left and right. It's where we go, oh, whoa, watch out there, buddy. Out of sight, out of mind, out of fright, out of, uh, lime. I don't got any limes left. That was a dumb hurt on my end. Very avoidable, but here we are in this limestone turmoil. I'm gonna go to the bottom. There ain't no killer wheel saws there. Put on your spike traps. Hey, DK, Donkey Kong. He's the leader of the bunch, you know. You might know him well. I got his money. What the hell? I, I look. I had I had to force the rhyme here. It's not my fault. It's all about the radio stations of the 1980s. If you don't understand what I mean, good. That means you're protected. So don't worry about. Hey, another midpoint. We got these weird marathon levels in this game that I just did not suspect would happen. Hey, wheel. Is anything beyond there? I don't know. It just looks like a dead end to me. I want to guard and go up a tree, but I can't do either. Super wheel. Came to say hello. And, uh, you know what? I try to be polite. <laughs> oh, I got this banana in the corner, though. Yeah, corner banana. Now there's a reason to live. It's just weird enemy. Like, I still don't understand physically, like, what it is. Okay, you're supposed to go down here, by the way. But hey, Donkey has the ability to meld himself completely almost inside a rock wall, serving as a protective layer of mineral. Oh boy, okay, there's multiple wall, wall, wall wheel, wheel wall, everyone panic. <sighs> Saw this bunch of bananas, I was like, I'm gonna follow that line! I followed that line right into a rocky end, smushed my face, broke a tooth. Whoa, geez, and lost my will to ever eat food on a plate ever again. What a tragic story, full of breathing apparatuses, composure, and uh, a large amount of bacterial farms. So you gotta be careful about those, right? Like, they're good to study, but do not ingest. K-O-N-G! What does that spell? Carnival! Yeah! I still haven't played for an hour yet. There you go, well... I can go to that level and get a bomb, maybe? Or I can go here where nothing happens. Weird! Hey, look at that giant clam there on the map. Well, let's do that weird dead end and see what happens. Because, like, all the paths are there. They don't really vary. Let's see what happens if I... Oh man, we're just swimming every day here. Whoa, jeez. Shark. 
Shark attack. Shark. Well, fish. Yeah, I just squeeze on by. All on purpose. I've never seen so much purpose. Well, look at that. It spells DK. See, that stands for Dynamo Koala. It's the head uh, hiring enterprise on DK Island. They're really a big fan of animals that are not indigenous to that land. You know, that's what they're all about. Fish bite. Here we go. Oh, jeez. Yeah, there's a lot of fish here that wants to have a nibble upon all the precious meat upon myself because that is what I'm made of. If I could change things a bit, I would instead be made of pastrami. Well, no, I think people would still be way into eating up parts of my body if that was the case. It would not be a good defense strategy, is what I'm saying, you know? When, when you become a species, you have decisions to make on how you will protect your body and your family. Deciding to be a dish that people would buy money for to eat normally is considered a bad strategy, but I mean, hey, maybe you thought of a plan that no one has thought before of, so like, I don't want to discourage you from giving it a shot. A lot of fish here. They're all excited about being fish. And I can't blame them, you know? I've seen footage of a fish once somewhere. It looks like a fun life. Move back and forth, you're always full of wet bubbles, get eaten by an octopus. Like, these are all sounds like wonderful things. I understand what he would like to protect that lifestyle of theirs. Hey, there's a bomb to blow up a thing. Oh, so you go here to blow up the rocks. You can go to the pl Now I understand. Video games, it all makes sense. I haven't gotten a single bonus today. So the top level leads nowhere then, or maybe you get two levels where you can get a bomb at. I like how they kind of preserve that, like, uh, I less less like how the music resets. I mean, might as well just blow up that ledge now, I guess. You know, bang, walking back and forth pretty right. Yeah, that's right. And then the bomb didn't explode, but it stopped being. Next time, I'm gonna go to the potato place and order a pizza.